Hello everyone, my name is Tom Rennick and I'm a forecaster here in the Grand Junction Forecast Office here today to talk to you about lightning. So obviously thunderstorms can produce tornadoes, flash flooding, hail, strong winds, but they can also produce lightning which is very dangerous. In fact, on average in the United States, 49 people get killed by lightning every year. Last year in 2020, that number luckily dropped down to 17, but unfortunately one of those individuals was in Colorado. So it is important that you know the proper steps to protect yourself from lightning. The number one way to really protect yourself is to realize or know if lightning is forecast for that day. The best way is to go to your uh, weather service office at weather.gov gjt and check the latest forecast. You can also go to our social media posts on Facebook or Twitter where you can see various um, thoughts on what we think for lightning for that day. So, how do you protect yourself? Well, when you're outside and lightning is occurring or looks to be occurring, really the only way to stay safe is to get into a building or another structure. That's it. It's the only way. However, having said that, getting into a car and making sure the windows are rolled up and the windows are closed will also protect you. So what happens if you can't find a substantial structure? Well, we suggest that you avoid open fields, as you can see in this video, and also stay away from high objects like uh, trees or power lines. So if you are inside and lightning is occurring, we suggest that you stay away from windows and doors. And interestingly, landline telephone use, now this is landline, not mobile, um, is the leading cause of indoor lightning injuries. So obviously, don't make any phone calls unless it's an emergency. Finally, it is a common misconception that once lightning is no longer visible, that you're no longer under threat. That's just simply not true. We recommend that you wait for 30 minutes until you hear that last clap of thunder before resuming any outdoor activities. Please remember our slogan, when thunder roars, go indoors. Thank you.